What's going on guys, it's Mesoar Jagan here, welcome back to the channel, if you are new then welcome to the channel. For today's video, as you guys see, is going to be an MFM and I'm going to basically be freestyling, no, not freestyling as in rapping, but freestyling from talking from the top of my head so that this can be as natural as possible. I don't have a script in front of me, and yeah, if I mess up, then I mess up, oh well. <laughs> but basically, this video is going to be about... Uh, the games, the following games that I would like to add on to the channel and where this channel is going really. So if you guys look at my little about section on my YouTube channel, I said that I wanted to be an all around YouTuber and when I meant all around, I meant gaming, I meant vlogging as well. So my skits, let's talk about that. So far I've done two little skits. My little Valentine's Day one, I wanted to do something different with my MFM and I wasn't expecting it to do as well as it did. A lot of people said they were crying, a lot of people said it was really, really funny and I wasn't expecting that to be honest. I was just making a skit out of the situation that I was personally in. <laughs> I didn't have a Valentine's Day. It's not really funny. Um, moving on, <laughs> I made my second skit. And right now it's around 97 views and a lot of you came out of the woodworks and was like, yo, this is great. So I appreciate it. I really did not think that you guys, well, you guys said that you wanted me to, you know, uh, continue my skits. But I didn't, I honestly didn't think that it was going to do as well as it did. So I want to confirm that anytime I do get an idea, uh, I will be putting it into a skit. And, you know, I made my little logo for Metsu skits. So, they won't be coming out a lot because with that one, as you guys see, you know, it's low production. You know, I use my tablet. My tablet has a pretty good camera, but I want to at least make the most out of what I can do out of this skit versus, oh yeah, he just recorded this and there's some funny jokes in it. I want to try to get some good camera angles and whatnot. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and confirm right now. And I really, really, really appreciate you guys. And it makes me feel really, really freaking good because I love acting. I honestly want to be either a voice actor or an actor um, as I grow more towards adulthood and being independent. So with you guys, you know, giving me that support, I really, really appreciate it. And it, it's just, you know, a, a really, really big dream of mine. Outside of, you know, traveling and playing video games, well, traveling to play video games at tournaments and stuff like that. My main goal would be to be a voice actor or an actor in general. You guys could go to my Sinran Kagura video and I gave it my all to say Metsu Hadoken. Or no, no, Shinku Hadoken. And that, that shows where I want to voice act. I freaking love battle cries and all that. Anyway, moving on. The next thing that I wanted to talk about would be the following games that I would like to add on to the channel. Recently, um, well, basically all this time, majority of the time, I just upload, you know, a random game and you guys may not see it coming. So I want to, you know, every so often, if, you know, you guys are getting used to a general flow of games, I would like to, before I add on new games to the channel, I'd like to make a video like this. Uh, of course, not as long, but basically give my reasoning or just say what games I want to add on. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Starting off is Ibn Ab. It Ob was a PlayStation 3 and PC game. I don't know if it's on Xbox, but I freaking loved it. It's hands down by far one of my favorite games because I typically don't play puzzle games, but this game really, really grabbed my attention and I loved it. I kid you not. My friend and I that played on PlayStation 3, we sat down in one level for four hours straight because we couldn't figure it out. Once we finally did, we were like, wow, are you kidding me? Just to get stuck again. <laughs> but the game is amazing. I freaking love it. So Pixis, you guys may know him. If you don't, then, you know, he streams on Twitch. I was about to say Twitter. I usually say Twitter anytime I want to say Twitch anyway. He also has a YouTube channel, and I don't know when his YouTube channel is going to get active again, but either way, this is basically my right-hand man. I love this man to death. He is a great guy, and uh, yeah, I will be doing some Ibn Ob gameplay with him because the game is actually quite difficult to play alone. The next game would be Fancy Star Online. I don't expect any of you guys to know this game just because it is a PC game, but it was also on Dreamcast. If I'm correct, it was one of the first games to ever be online on consoles. I know that I'm pretty sure that PC games were online and then Fancy Star was the first online console game. But it is a Dreamcast game, then went on to GameCube and original Xbox. But 
Fantasy Star Online is one of my childhood favorites. My dad brought me up on it and I played it a lot. So I would actually love to do probably a full playthrough of the missions in that game. You know, it goes Force 1, Force 2, Boss. Force, no, Force 1, Force 2, Boss, Cave 1, Cave 2, Cave 3, and then Boss. Then Mines 1, Mines 2, Mines 3, Boss, Ruins 1, Ruins 2, Ruins 3, and then Boss. But yeah, I love the game to death, and it's amazing. So, I don't expect any of you guys to watch it, but because of nostalgia and my childhood purposes, I'd really, really love... Now that I have the equipment to record, I'd love to, as my future self from my childhood, actually record this and have it somewhere where I can look back and be like, yeah, this is a game that I love and I have it somewhere that I do love as well. Because, you know, my YouTube channel is really a big part of me. I, I don't do much, play games, record, edit, and that's about it. So, you know, being Metsu Arjakin, that's really really fun to me so i think that it holds deep meaning to of, of course play like a childhood game on my youtube channel and just you know have fun with it moving on the next game would be oh my notes locked okay the next game was going to be warriors orochi 3 ultimate you know dynasty wars games is pretty fun and the reason why i wanted to record some warriors orochi 3 ultimate not much content <laughs> so it may not go far but i at least want to record some episodes with it not episodes but just videos on it really nobody plays the game online so i'd be playing it by myself and uh, i already beaten the game i'm only missing one character and the gauntlet mode i can last the whole entire hour so i don't i don't know what the heck i do in that game <laughs> i don't even know if i'm gonna have a lot of videos on it but i do have an intro for it and i'd like to use it instead of just have it on my computer and just collecting uh what what would be uh mechanical dust what what, what would be like uh technological dust how how would you how would you go about saying that if it's inside the computer like in a in a okay whatever next game <laughs> will be brawlhalla the first video that i'd upload on this will be without commentary and i oh my goodness if you guys don't know what brawlhalla is is basically a free to play smash bros on pc and sometime i don't know when it's supposed to come on playstation 4 but i almost got three stocked by this guy i was in the red in one stock and he still had three stocks and i came back on him one more hit and i basically would have died and amazingly i came back on him so <laughs> that will be the first video showing you guys that not clutch but true skill don't you dare say it was freaking clutch but yeah I definitely want to upload that and then continue playing Brawlhalla, you know, just every so now, every so now, every, how do I, how do I say that? Every so now and then? Every, that's a weird way to say it. Every, every now and then. I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to say every now and then. So yeah, play some ranked in Brawlhalla every now and then. Next up, a subscriber, I don't remember the name, but he said that, you know, well, he actually asked me, am I going to play Drawn to Death upon launch? Drawn to Death is out. I did download it. I played it. Didn't like it. What I didn't like about it was the damage. Okay? Now, I did love the movement. I love the art style. The game is freaking amazing. It looks great. It moves great. I freaking love it. But I hated the damage. Now, I actually started to like it. You guys may be saying, you know, RJ, make up your mind. Come on now. Stop. And I think that this game has... It has, I can't really explain it, but if you guys look at the reviews on IGN, I think that it's misinterpreted. There we go. The way that I look at the game is like a Smash Bros. loadout. It's heavily, heavily, heavily relatable to loadout because loadout doesn't really have any balances and you may feel like, oh my gosh, my weapons don't do any damage, but yet everybody can insta-kill me. The reason being is because the only way that your weapons get stronger is when you level up in loadout. So really to be getting the most out of loadouts and to really be playing loadout you need to be a level 20. other than that lower levels get destroyed by higher levels so there's no real balance there unless everybody in the lobby is level 20 therefore everybody can kill everybody around the same pace now within drawn to death i was like what the heck these assault rifles do one and two damage and you have 100 percent health and there's these other weapons that do crazy damage so what did i do 
you know, I was like, all right, I see this man using this weapon. Let me see what he's using. I went ahead and picked it on myself. I was like, holy crap, this has humming missiles on it. I started using that, loved it. I love sniping as well. So I picked up a sniper and that was my combo really. I hit him with two humming missiles and then pop him off with snipers. And you know, that's where I was getting most of my damage from. Then I mixed it up. I was like, okay, this man's shooting me with a shotgun and doing crazy damage. I had no idea shotguns did that much damage. Let me see what's up. I actually went to the training grounds, used a shotgun. And the crazy thing about this shotgun is that if you can land two close up hits with it, basically these blades come out of the shotgun. If you hit with long range, they don't come out. If you hit up close, they come out. If you get two good hits in, you know, these blades will start coming out and then you have to perfect reload as if you're playing Gears of War. Once you do that, they start revving up and spinning. After you hit the first hit, it does 70 freaking damage. On average, any weapon is going to hit one and two damage, like with the assault rifles. This shotgun hits 70 freaking damage. So basically, if you hit two hits with those blades, if you hit both of those blades, they're going to die. There's no living through that. Also, say if I miss one blade, but I hit the other. As long as you get one hit with the blades, it also does damage over time. So it continuously slices them for one and two damage. So if I can keep on popping off my rifle hits, if I shoot you one time with my rifle and you run away, you're dead. You can't get a, you can't get rid of the effect. So basically, the way that I looked at this game is heavily compared to loadout. And really where the damage comes from is by certain weapons that you're going to need to buy. Because the assault rifles aren't going to push you through being 110% honest. They're really only good for back damage or if they're trying to run away from you and you're just trying to get the quick kill just by spraying and praying. Other than that, the real uh, quote-unquote balance or, you know, kills from the game comes from getting those specific weapons and then really knowing how to use your abilities with your character. I use Ninja. She's sexy. She's a goddamn shark. Ninja. Badass. Big titty. Big ass. Nin ninja girl. And she has the most adorable voice. I love her. So her abilities, she can, um, if you're able to hit the uh, Poseidon's anchor, it actually locks them down to the ground. They can still jump around and stuff, but they're locked to that general area. Then you can switch it up to throwing her sharks, which is basically explosive sharks. And then the last shark that she throws is actually a really, really big damaging one. So that's basically some extra grenades that I have. And she also has her hook. If you hook an enemy and you press R2, then it does big damage to them as well. And also you can hook across the screen. I don't think there's any limit to how far you can hook. So she can really get out of like dire situations. And if I see like a health kit, I can go ahead and hook towards it and you know sling myself you know across the freaking level and she also has a shield that she can put up by doing a backflip i really like her i haven't really played any of the other people other than um bronco because bronco bodies ninja in a 1v1 and yeah his abilities are just crazy if you have the right weapons and you use his abilities correctly in a 1v1 anyway you know i i typically like the game you can't really get mad at it because if you get mad at it then it's not going to really do you any good just like getting mad at loadout the game is broken so expect that the game is really just for fun and this game honestly i enjoy more than loadout you know i enjoy loadout just because you know you can kind of roll like gears of war but this game has a lot more movement than loadout and i just enjoy it 10 times more than loadout so if you guys are interested then let me know and i'd definitely be uploading some gameplay on that i do have three videos that i you know did on uh, playstation 4 it was some really good matches that i did went ahead and saved the video clip so i'll be uploading those so that you guys can see me playing drawn to death and then if you guys would like to you know see me play it even more then i'll start putting commentary over it and uh yeah just tell me if you guys are interested in watching me play drawn to death after you see the clips that i go ahead and upload um the last game i don't know if i said the last game for drawn to death but i just realized i had one more will be tekken 7 a while back i uploaded that my body was ready because i did a whole bunch of push-ups for tekken 7 and tekken 7 is just another fighting game i freaking love tekken i love fighting games and yeah i was thinking about getting king of fighters but i don't know i've heard that the net coding in that game isn't really the best so that's that's kind of what's scaring me but tekken 7 is definitely a must i love tekken to death and that's about it for tekken <laughs> now there's one more thing that i'm going to have to cover because this guy I have to say hands down is probably my favorite subscriber um 
well one of my favorite subscribers let me get that straight before some of you get butt hurt <laughs> because you guys know that for my favorite subscribers i show love to you i show love to everybody but my favorites you guys know who you are so this specific favorite i'm gonna go ahead and talk about is of course swaggy swagger mick swaggerson this dude came from let it die and a lot of my you know let it die subscribers have went ahead and left and this dude pulled through this man was like i don't give a freak what you upload what you play what you do i'm here for you homie shut up i'm here for you i got you yo I, I love you right now i'm telling you that right now and all my other favorite subscribers but let me go ahead and read what he said and i quote and like many of your subs and friends told you just do your videos whenever you feel like it no pressure you would get your creative juices flowing if you just take it easy instead of a massive upload random garbage so <laughs> this is honestly what made me want to tell you guys what i'm going to upload because i agree with him random game random garbage you know just commentating over it just for a video to be on my channel i'd like to be more interactive with you guys i already interact a crap ton with commenting and liking and loving all of your comments as soon as you guys comment you know i try to do it as fast as possible but i want to try to be even more structured you know i uh, i'd like to disregard the uh uploading schedule and just upload whenever i'd like because that's honestly what you guys pushed me to not in a bad way but you guys were like yo metsu chill out we don't want a bunch of random dumb videos we'd like you to you know take your time get your creative juices flowing and then upload when you can so i really really appreciate that i really really love you guys for that and so with that being said i still like to get at least one video out a week but even then i'm not gonna worry about it that much i'm gonna tell you guys right now i have i think two videos coming out each week up until may 22nd or so but yeah the reason being i try to get so many videos out is because i personally think about it i'm like okay i like cross counter and they upload a new episode of excellent adventures every sunday now because i like that show so much i just yearn and yearn and yearn and yearn and i'm like oh sunday please come Urgh, i want to watch excellent adventures and i can't because it comes out every sunday so for people that do like my videos i like to you know ease that sensation to you know uploading these videos but then again on the flip side i'm like okay if i do this more than likely they're not going to watch every single video so that's a lot of videos going to waste so the less videos that i do the more likely you guys would actually watch but again it's like sensation versus logic sensation versus logic so i i don't know i, I don't know i'm just telling you guys that i did a lot of recording over the this spring break and i actually go back to school monday and i think today is the eighth am i correct no today is the tenth because yeah today's monday F okay whatever anyway as I was saying, I'll definitely keep that in mind. If I can't upload a video that week, I'm not going to worry about it. The next video that I do upload, I'll be sure to, you know, edit it to the best of my extent and basically just do as you guys say and take your advice. And it's really, really good advice and I appreciate it. So if I can get back on a the schedule, then I will. But as of right now, I would really want to focus on talking to you guys more telling you what games i'd like on this channel and what i'm going to be doing and where this channel is going versus not really talking to you guys like this and uploading quote unquote random garbage as i agree with you know three videos a week so i'll keep it at that i'll be uploading videos as i can and if i can't then you guys are just gonna have to wait <laughs> and if you comment and you know you want to talk to me then of course i'm going to be replying and uh yeah before i go i was in the range of 3053 for the longest and now i'm at 3093 i want to tell you guys right now if you're subscribing for let it die or from let it die i appreciate it but unless some crazy ass game changing shit I'm cursing for a reason. Happens to that game, I'm not going back to it. And I'm telling you right now, I'm being the best man that I can. Because I do not, 
I do not want to waste your guys' time. You're like, what the hell? I, I subscribed for Let It Die. <laughs> Why am I here? He's not right. Okay, just, just, just right now. If you're subbed for me, I appreciate it. If you're subbed for Let It Die, go, go look at Jack Frost. Because apparently, now that I stopped Let It Die, he's the new Let It Die guy. Which I'm gonna say it right now. I do not agree. I do not agree with that. Nope. I reached out to him. He didn't reach back. So to the shadow run with him. Any hoosies. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, yeah, if you guys comment, you know I'll reply. Hope you guys again enjoy this video. This is Messor Jacob. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.